Welcome back to YouTube. Uh, this is a follow-up video to a video released at the end of February this year. Uh, basically, uh, I've noticed OBS have had uh, a new update this week, so I'm going to make a part two to this video. Basically, this is uh, if you're having problems with your webcam, uh, you're getting a blank screen when you add your video capture device. This is a follow-up. Uh, it's July, and I thought I best do a follow-up because I'm getting a lot of views, uh, a lot of comments, a lot of people saying it was work. There's the odd few people that are saying it doesn't work. So I'm going to make one that's a bit more clearer uh, and show you uh, how to do it if you're having problems with your webcam on OBS. So sit back, relax, and let's get it on. Right, guys. This is what you have to do when you first install OBS. You're going to have to go down to Scenes, add a new scene. Uh, remember to name it something because uh, you can have you know, multiple scenes uh, where you can adjust settings for each scene so i'm just going to label this one uh, name it sorry uh, rick scene uh, once you've done that click on ok and now it's time to add another source so you want to uh, add your sound source first so uh, i'm going to go ahead and add my microphone which will be the uh, samsung go mic so i'm just going to Add that now, click OK, and then once that's edited, I'm going to go back to the add sign and I'm going to add my display capture, which is basically what's ever on my monitor screen, it's going to capture that. So, as you can see, that's been added and picking up straight away. Next up is the most important thing is the video capture device. Now I'm using the uh, Logitech C920, I've updated mine since uh, my last video, so it pops up straight away, uh, unlike the uh, HP uh, HD webcam did. Uh, what you want to do is, if you're getting a grey screen, which I'm just going to uh, show you what it will look like, you'll get a, a preview screen that looks like that. Uh, you want to head on down to Resolution, underneath Custom, Drop it down to uh, 800 by 600, it should pop up like it has done there. And then go back into resolution and pick out 1080 res and it should still be on there. So you'll get a massive nice preview like that and then you can adjust it to whatever you want. You've still got your screen capture behind that. A lot of people will do the uh, video capture first and then do a display capture and what it does it hides behind each other so it doesn't look like your webcam is there so I hope I, I've explained it and that's how uh, you get your webcam in OBS to work when it doesn't preview on the preview screen thanks for watching